Good morning, Johnson Learning Leopards. Today is Thursday, April 28th. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Please pause for the moment of silence on level zero. Alright everybody, happy Thursday. We have two birthdays today and they are London Jackson in first grade and Mrs. Schaff in third grade. So happy birthday to both of you. We love you. We hope you have a great day. Then um, we are having our school-wide morning meeting tomorrow. Um, so I'm going to announce tomorrow's and the weekend birthdays. And they are Max Morris in fourth grade and Miss Watts in second grade. And we love you guys too and we wish you a happy a little bit of an early birthday. All right, we have some open-minded leopard leaders to share about. From Miss Leonard's class, Naomi Williams is a very actively engaged learning leopard. She engages with all of our read-alouds and will always share out ideas and strategies uh, while we are learning. Keep it up, Naomi. For Miss Watts class, Flora Moon is the definition of actively engaged. She is always focused and ready to help. She is always willing to participate and knows our classroom expectations like the back of her hand. She is always encouraging and so much fun. We, uh, she always brings a smile to my face. We love you, Flora. From Ms. Schaff's class, Sammy Brinson is very engaged in our lessons and has great ideas and extra things to add to our discussions. He comes to school each day with a positive attitude about learning. Keep it up, Sammy. From Ms. Rickabaugh's class, Hope Dwolo is such a hard worker. She takes on a challenge and works hard to overcome it. She can also brighten your day with a smile or a hug. Keep up the great work, Hope. And from Ms. Whalen's class, Lizzie Nagley is, very engaged, is a very engaged member of our class, especially when discussing issues from history. Lizzie can always be counted on to think deeply about a topic and keep the conversation going. So great job to all of those actively engaged leopard leaders. And now please join me in reciting the Johnson Code of Conduct. As a Johnson learning leopard, I come to learn. I promise to roar by being respectful, open-minded, actively engaged and responsible. I will always try my best. All right, news you can use. Um, some fun days today. It's National Blueberry Pie Day. It is National Great Poetry Reading Day today, so maybe go out and read some, po some poems. Um, it's National Superhero Day, um, and it's National Teach Children to Save Day, meaning save money. Like, don't just get money and go out and spend it. You should save some, because you never know when you, want, you might want to buy something. All right. Also, a reminder, I said this earlier, but we are having our May school-wide morning meeting tomorrow, and I have a couple important and fun things to share. Um, first of all, it's going to be out side. It's going to be on the little blacktop near the little playground. And we sent all the teachers a little seating chart. So you'll there's going to be an area where every grade level is. So they're kind of together. Um, I want you guys to start thinking about um, some ways that you can roar at an assembly or at a school-wide morning meeting. We have not had any really big group events since like February of 2020. Some of you that are watching this have literally never been to an assembly at our school. So this is the first time that we're coming together in a while. So I want you to start thinking about ways that you are going to roar and show roaring behavior while we're all together because that's a lot of people out on the blacktop at one time. Um, third thing, there are gonna be some times that are super exciting and you are gonna be able to cheer and laugh and play games. Then there are going to be some times where we're going to ask you to be on level zero. So just be prepared for that and make sure that you are giving your attention, <clears throat> excuse me, to whoever is up front leading at, um, leading at any time. And if they ask you to be on a level zero, make sure that you go on a level zero. Um, and then finally, and this might be most important, Get ready to have some fun. It's going to be so awesome. We are so excited. Um, the change challenge ends today at the end of the school day. Then we're going to count up. Uh, the PTO is going to count up how much money there is. And then that grade level gets to turn me into a human ice cream sundae tomorrow if you meet the goal. So get ready. It's going to be awesome. All right. Today's joke of the day comes from Aramod Allen in Miss Rickaball's class. What do you call an alligator in a suit? What do you call an alligator in a suit? Well, an investigator, of course. 
get it. An investigator has the word gator in it, but it's an alligator. Yeah, I love it, Aramont. Thank you for sharing that. And that's all I have for you guys today. I hope that you have a thrilling, thrilling Thursday and think about how you can roar today here at Johnson. We love you so much. Have a great day. Um, next time I'll see you, we'll be live at the school one morning meeting on Friday morning. Woo, peace.